Hey guys, it's Hammies for Life 1 here, and today is going to be a review on the Medium Flying Saucer. I think the brand is Sharp Hills and Grant, but they do like potty litters and that, so yeah. Um, I'd suggest that if you have a big Syrian hamster, get in the large flying saucer, as it can be in some aspects small for big Syrian. Um, but if you're small in Syrian, like this one here, I would say it's fine. And if you have a dwarf, um, this, there, I, I would suggest this one's quite good too. But the only problem is it's hard to get, um, hold of the large ones, really, because I've looked on their website, they don't see prices and that, so I went for the medium one. I would say this, um, is quite a good will, actually, as it's completely quiet, it's safe, and the good news is my hamster hasn't chewed it yet, so, you know, unless you just know this is where he keep, because his, um, the wheel is right by the bars, this is pickles I'm on about, um, she, um, sits on the wheel and she starts to spin round when she's trying to get to the bars, so it's kind of stopped her from chewing the bars a bit too, and going on her wheel, so, yeah, it's quite good, um, it's tail safe, solid running surface and 360 degrees of fun on the run so as you see it has a gerbil on the front too but if you like you have two gerbils I would just get in the large so they can both you know have a run um it's 16.5 inches which is 16.5 centimeters and 6.5 inches so I will show you it at the moment but my, it's in my because it's cage, so can't really get it out she's sleeping. And it's the safest exercise toy in the world. Yeah, and luckily it's squeak resistant, so most nights I'm trying to um, get to sleep and I hear the wheel going round and round. Oh, by the way, this is a roly wheel that does this, and yeah, and I've tried using some Vaseline, and it's just not doing anything. It's just acting the same. I don't know if it's where, because on my, um, cage is, like, a base there, then a, um, the metal bars, because when the wheel is on the bars, because the hamster puts weight on, it knocks against the bar, so that might be what's squeaking, because when I do it normally, it just goes, zoop, like that, but when it's on the bars, it goes, squeak, and it's really annoying, so... I just got this for a trial, like I said in my video about it, and I hope it goes well because it looks really cool actually. And you can get it in three colours, which is purple, blue, and green, which I got green. Yeah, and I didn't really like the blue one or the purple one, so yeah. Just hope it goes well. Um. Because I haven't ever seen a, a silent spinner yet, and I was going to get one of them, but I couldn't find one, so I went with the flying saucer. And I only got that for £5.25, which I, wasn't actually that bad. So, and I got it from my local pet store, so I didn't actually really travel far. So, thanks for watching. Um, by the way, I will be doing requests. If you can comment on my page, like if you want a request or something, and you can rate this video, like this video, or um, subscribe to my channel so I can like like show you um, if I've done more or anything. So I'll probably be doing like about two videos a day. And so, yeah, thanks for watching. Bye.